all still remember the story of this girl? She's a boy, but pretended to be a girl. And she went from this to this. Okay, I'll refresh your memories if you do not still remember the story of this girl. So this is Eniola. My name is Lambert Eniola, Mr. Brown. Ah, your name is what? Lambert Eniola, Mr. Brown. You be makeup, you makeup artist? Yes, I'm a makeup artist. Are you serious? I don't get support that. That's why I'm selling bottles for the inside traffic. In the air, that's why she do it. She sell bottles on the she not a bag. So our popular comedian, Brain Jota, on his way to somewhere, saw this girl in traffic selling this water and he decided to help her so this girl because she was a boy and she was disabled she was not able to gain favor from anyone so because of that he decided to be dressing like a woman so maybe he could be able to gain favor he's a makeup artist like he said but he was still not getting work because of his disability so one day he met this popular comedian brain jota and he gave him half a million and posted her video on the internet and from there people started donating you know just trying to help this girl so but nobody knew that she was not actually a girl it was after the people who knew her in real life when this video was going viral because this video caught millions of views on the internet and many personnel were interested in her story and wanted to help her come out of the poverty so people who also know her in real life also saw this video and decided to expose her i'm not i'm telling this story i'm not saying this story for to support what she did or that I'm against what she did. But what I'm trying to let us know, we live in a society that is very easy for a woman, you know, to be able to gain some favors from people. That is the kind of society we live. We should try to make our society to be favorable for both men and women it shouldn't be only one-sided you will see some women walk into an office they will be able to gain that job because they are women they because they are female and when a boy or a guy goes for the same position they will be denied simply because they are men or because they are boys so our society is so mean that it favors women so easily than both genders. This is why I'm making this video. And this was the reason why this young girl you saw here decided to turn herself into a woman instead of being a man that she is just so because she could gain favor from people. And it, it worked for her. Anyway, she was not arrested because so many people helped her, even the governor of Ocean State, you know, asked for her details and so many personnel, I don't want to mention them, also sent her token. And she made millions, okay, until they find out that she was actually a boy and not a girl. So what I'm saying in essence is, we should make our society to be favorable for both men and women. I'm not saying what she did is right, but this is the reason why so many guys are cross-dressing in Nigeria. And the likes of Bob Risky, James Brown, and so many of them. So we should be able to make our society to be favorable to all. Share this video so it will get to the right people to make our society favorable to all gender. See you guys on my next one.